Skeletons are creeping out of Meek Mill's closet as new physical abuse allegations are surfacing. According to a former close friend of Mill, the Philadelphia rapper was severely abusive to Nicki Minaj during the course of their two-year relationship. Oh God, um, it was, a, it was the, one of the um, hardest parts of my career to, to date, ever, yeah. The abuse allegations from the source are serious. Meek allegedly treated Nikki like garbage during their relationship between 2015 and 2017, and they were constantly in explosive arguments. That was one of those things that he, you know, he shouldn't have done, and I told him before he did it. But he did it, and um, it is what it is, you know. The ex-friend named Dean says he witnessed Meek do vile things like spitting on Minaj and locking her out of their house in the middle of the night. I had a lot of anger and hate for him. He further claims that Meek was very insecure about his relationship with Minaj, which only fueled the abusive behavior. The disturbing stories were explained in an Instagram Live video from Dean himself. Talking about how Meek kicked Nikki out of a remote residence they were staying at, he says, If we are, if, if, when you, if, we, if, you, if you from Philadelphia, man, y'all already know what's up with me and Meek, man. Man, I put her out in the woods. We was always out Jersey somewhere in the woods. Nigga put her out the house in the dark and shit. I had to go out there and get her. She cried right here. Am I lying, Nikki? The abuse allegedly took place between 2015 until the end of their relationship in early 2017. But at the time of the breakup, Nikki was tight-lipped about the abuse. Because of the way he handled the breakup publicly. And, um, and I know he was hurt, you know, he was like, look, this was my first time being in love and I didn't know how to handle it. Sources reported in January 2017 that Meek and Minaj were fighting on and off for a little while about a few topics that upset Nikki. They had a bigger fight and then called it quits, the source said. It took three years for Nikki to even mention Meek's abusive behavior, first speaking out against him in 2020. Following a very public Twitter spat between the estranged pair, Minaj claimed that Meek filmed himself beating her up, and also said that he physically attacked his own sister and mother. Meek denied the claims at the time, but now, with Dean's input, the scary and abusive pattern seems more likely. Fans are responding with mixed emotions to the allegations. For one, it seems that most fans are not happy with a third party airing Nikki's private experiences. A user on Lipstick Alley commented, If she hadn't talked about this, why does anyone else feel comfortable putting this out there? I don't care for Nikki, but this could be a painful subject for her. Nobody deserves to be abused. Others voiced issue with Dean only coming forward now, over seven years later, and only after he had a falling out with Meek Mill. Just like the P. Diddy situation, these men only come forward when they have a falling out with the abuser. Where was Dean's concern back in 2015 and 2016, when Nikki was allegedly getting abused? A third comment echoes, that lady has moved on from him. If you weren't vocal about the shit and standing to defend her when it happened, shut up about it now. What do you think about Dean exposing Meek Mill's alleged abuse? Let us know in the comments below.